Another reason expectations are so high for the Utes is the experience and talent on the roster. In January, Lucky Fotu, Bradley and Nye, Julian Blackman, and Zach Moss put off the NFL to make a run together at a Pac-12 championship. Yeah, those are talented guys. Zach Moss, he's got a chance to become the all-time leading rusher in Utah history, but returning for his senior season was about more than just football. When Lucky Fotu and Bradley and I and Julian Blackman and Zach Moss say they're coming back, what was your reaction? Pac-12 championship. I mean, those guys are important to our team and can really help us and have helped us up until this point. So, I mean, it was just kind of a reload in a sense, just let's put our bullets back in and go at it. It, it kind of solidified the real feeling that we all had that we could be really good this year. Each and every individual that you mentioned, all of our mentalities and our expectations for ourselves pretty much exceeds any other expectations that come our way. I think every, every one of them made the decision on their own. There was no collaborative effort, you know, we're all going to come back or we're all going to leave. And I think all of them made the right decision. We definitely have no regrets of what has transpired in those past few years, and it's been a very, very enjoyable ride. Just a feeling in the atmosphere that people know we have potential and more potential than we've probably ever had. So wh when, that, when something like that happens, it's just kind of like, okay, they know, we know, now we gotta just go. There's risk coming back, there's no doubt about that, but I think the percentages are definitely in their favor, that more good can come out of it that, that outweighs the risk. Gives it to Zach Moss, runs to daylight, and runs to the end zone, touchdown! Why did you decide to come back to the University of Utah? Uh, I decided to come back. Um, I wanted to get my degree, for one. Uh, make sure I get that for me and myself and my family. Um, and set a role, uh, be an example um, to the kids back home in my uh, community and stuff like that. Um, and also, I didn't really want to pass up on an opportunity to play with these guys again. Toss sweep right side, Zach. He puts his foot in the ground. He's at the 10. He trolls man. Stays on his feet. 10, 5, touchdown! Touchdown! You have a chance to become the all-time leading rusher in Utah history. Does that mean something to you? Uh, it definitely means something to me. Um, when I came into Utah, I wanted to walk out of here as being one of the best to ever play the football at the school and definitely be uh, the best running back to uh, play here. And I think accomplishing some of those goals uh, is very special because a lot of guys that play college football can't say they have done something like that. We've had some really good backs come through the program, and, and for him to be able to leave if he has the type of year that we hope he has as the all-time most productive back in the history of Utah football, that's a, that's a, lot, that's a great accomplishment. The, the ball, so you have unfinished business? Nobody there. Pretty much, yeah. What is that business? To win the Pac-12 championship, um, be the first team in uh, school history to get that done, and then uh, hopefully get a berth um, in the college football playoffs.